watching India News Stream. This is Sana Aziz with today's news headlines. At least six civilians were killed, while over two dozen sustained injuries when Afghan forces fired rockets into the Pakistani territory. A Delhi court today granted interim bail to student activist Umar Khalid for a week to attend sister's wedding. Bollywood actor Nora Fatehi today filed a defamation suit against fellow actor Jacqueline Fernandez and some media organizations in the 200 crore rupees extortion case. In a major embarrassment for the CBI, the prime accused behind the massacre at Boktoi village in West Bengal's Birbhum district on March 21 this year died in CBI custody today evening at the central agency's camp in the same district. Retail inflation rate based on consumer price index combined has increased substantially during the last 5 years. Ending nearly 3 year break due to COVID-19 pandemic, flights between Chennai and Palali in North Sri Lanka resumed operations today. More than 2 months after the first Nord Stream gas leak was reported, methane levels are still elevated and may pose a threat to the ecosystem, researchers at the Swedish University said. The much expected new railway line between India and Bangladesh along Tripura would be operational in June next year. The Supreme Court today said that it would consider early listing by circulation bill Kisvanu plea seeking a review of the top court's May 2022 order. England earned a historic test series victory in Pakistan after tearaway pacer Mark Wood took the tourist to a tense 26 run win in the second test. That's all for now. We'll come back with more news updates shortly.